até os bens. Do you know what's going on today? No idea. And this always makes me nervous. He got us out here earlier than normal. And he's not telling us why. Wes doesn't know what is straight. What are you building here? I'm building a round pin. How's it look? If I do this, it looks good. What about now? Perfect. Don't look better? Yeah. I did open my mouth and I told the West that if he ran towards, got in the pen with a uh, shrub grubber and ran at him so many steps, I would give him some money and he didn't do it. Um, but I also didn't give him very much time. He needed to act fast. So Randy and I have created a challenge to pretty much set up a time where he can redeem himself. It's almost like a war zone out here. You always keep your head on the swivel. So we're gonna put Shrub Grubber in a pen. Last one, take your hand off the rail. Gets the cash. If you win, you get five hundo. All right. If you lose, okay, you have to rip up all your wranglers. No. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that, <laughs> that, yep. I mean, that's something really dear to your heart. I'm not burning up my clothes. <laughs> okay. How about you have to rip up the ones with two Copenhagen rings and. <laughs> I don't, even get, I don't even think I have a pair of Wranglers with two Copenhagen rings. Okay, at least one. That's all of them. <laughs> okay, there we go. Rodeo. How about if you lose, you have to pay rent? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I like it, Randy. How much is rent? <laughs> so, what's your rent? Uh, Your side of it? I think it's uh, 400. Yeah. And then your house is 1,000 square foot? Something like that, I don't know. His house is a little less than half, so less than half. I don't know, 175 sounds fair. He's got a washer and a dryer. He's got a stove and an oven. I'm also paying more money. Yeah, that's why yours is prorated. Prorated. You get 700 cash. If you lose, you start paying rent. Donnie, Today is May 1st. Wait, can't we do that with Don? Let Donnie in and we'll do the same thing. Oh, with you? <laughs> All right. Like, I'm in it. It's a new deal. You gotta pick your spot in the arena. Here, here's, here's my idea. Here's my thought. This panel and back is off limits, right? Yes. Yes. So it's from here out. Yes, that's oh, the. This right. is the arena. You gotta be in the arena. Like, okay, so no, that panel back there is not out. But how are you gonna have two feet in the arena? I'm just making sure you're not pulling no bull crap. Alright, I got my spot. Where is it? Huh? Where is it? As soon as you grab the fence, you can't let go. Wes, you're not in the arena. So... So, but, this is round one. Yeah. We got... What do you... How long do you think? How long should we do round one? I mean... So like, he comes around and he gets hooked, but he stands his ground and takes a hook in. Seven hundo, right? Yeah, if he doesn't climb up. So, but can I do, like, 
that, like as long as I'm on this panel. You just can't get your right feet up here. You, yeah, I would say you can go this from here to there. This Maybe depth. from here to here. What do you think? I think the half. The half? Here, put this on real quick. Try it on for size. Oh, dang. Easy truck driver. JB, what's happening? Man, you will never guess. We got a GoPro on Wes's chest. We've got shrub grubber in the out gate. And Wes and I are about to put a hand on a top rail and two feet in the arena. And if I lose, he gets $700. If he loses and I win, he has to start paying rent. <laughs> gotta be limber when they hook you. If you tense up, that's when you get hurt. Yeah, you gotta go no bones. Like a drunk in a car accident, he always survives. <laughs> yep. He's relaxed. Yep. You gotta relax and just take it. I think I'm gonna go to this back right corner. He doesn't ever go over here. You know what I'm saying? Wes chose like literally the closest spot to where that bull eats and drinks. Now, the Can Am is parked there. So that whole thing might deter him. Yeah. Ooh, boys. Hey. reasons why we didn't do the turn back pin. Um, one, Leroy didn't want to have to climb into anything to save anybody that was smaller than the arena, which is alarming because it's the same bull in a big arena, so is he going to save me in a big arena? Number two, Leroy and Donnie, I believe, conspired because they don't have a dog in the fight and they don't want to move panels. So this is now round two. Round two is just we're both on one side of the arena closer, Donnie and Leroy are gonna try to push the bull towards us if he doesn't come and hook one of us. There will be a round three. If this doesn't work, we're building a turn back pin. Or we're gonna do it in the back pins. That's that cool with you, Randy? Let's get it on. Hey, boo. Mr. Boo. <laughs> Mr. Shrub Grubber. And you know it's fair because he beat me at rock, paper, scissors, and then he picked that spot. I don't think the bull's gonna hook him. If you noticed, he went up, then I went up, my foot was down, he hooked my foot. Doesn't Watch bother DB. Oh, I'm watching my back. Me and Trub Grubber got an agreement that he only hooks Wes. Talked about it yesterday. Hmm. What rodeo time is this? I don't know. It's the rodeo time where Wes is started to pay rent. May 1st. May 1st. Happy Mustache May, buddy. Rent's due on the 4th, by the way. Whew. I'm not lying. For those of you wondering what YouTube youtubers make it is not at least at my size of youtube channel it is not seven hundred dollars a chance a, a video i promise 
You're a good renter too. Like you. Well, I, I mean, we got to make sure you pay rent on time, but like, yeah. like upkeep and everything. Yeah. <sighs> Thank you for watching this episode of Rodeo Time. I don't know what number Rodeo Time where Dale wins. <laughs> That's all of them. Pow pow and on to the next one.